Hello everyone, how's everyone doing? You guys doing good too? I'm doing good too. Welcome back on the Fujitsu Stylistic Q704 tablet. In this video session, we're going to be showing two types of photos. I'm going to be showing the tablet and the keyboard as well. So we're going to get a full glimpse of this device now in photos so we know where every single feature is on this device now. So I can show you everything as I go through the video. I will name you all the ports where they are from left, right, top, bottom, everywhere. Okay, so this is going to be pretty interesting. It's whatever I got today. So let's just get started. First of all, I'm going to go for the tablet, which is just a dis dis the display. Yeah, just hold on. There you have it. That's the display. Okay, in this picture you can see it's a display, right? And the water splashed over. You see, this is a waterproof tablet as well, which I probably didn't mention. Probably in my videos, probably did. I can't remember. This device is waterproof, and you can see the water is spilled on the screen on the right hand side, and it helps greatly because if a device is waterproof yeah as at least you know the water won't go inside of this thing everything on this device is like uh covered so the water doesn't actually go inside of it well m most of it you can see the screen is waterproof anyway so enjoy the image Next image. So the next image I'm going to be showing you will be okay. Is this one? Might be a similar thing, but you know, it's in a different angle, isn't it? <laughs> So I'll just check this out. It's really, really beautiful the device though, eh? You can tell it's very, very strong casing on it. So enjoy the image. Okay, next image. Okay, that's enough of the display now. Now we're gonna go into where it looks like a keep uh, for laptop. Take a look at this image. We're going to go into the ports a bit later, so don't worry about that. So just enjoy the image. So that looks like with the tablet and the keyboard. Alright. So no problem there. image which will be this one yeah sorry big <laughs> pretty little there 
So now you got a clear thing here, which I was mentioning in my videos previously. That's the tablet, okay? This is the thing I was called tablet support. Where the tablet goes inside of this holder. Can you see that? And there's the keyboard with all the keys. And there's the touchpad and also the mouse buttons from left and right. Enjoy the image. Wow, check this out. Now you got all this stuff like Netflix, all that kind of stuff on it. Emails, <laughs> photos, you know the main tablet screen you have in tablet mode. Check this out, man. Looks absolutely the Fujitsu Stylistic Q704 tablet with the keyboard. Looks really super stylish, doesn't it? Look how beautiful it looks. Looks absolutely marvelous. Looks like a real laptop. Here you can see is a USB port and a VGA port on this side. Okay. We're gonna go more into the ports anyway, so just enjoy the image. Now we're going to go into our next image. Okay. Yeah, we're just going to another one like that. The screen's turned off. In this image, it's more clear, isn't it? Look. USB port. And a VGA pause over here, you can see it. And the touchpad's over here, isn't it? So enjoy the image. Okay, let's go into the next image. Right, now we're gonna go into this this image, okay? What they've done here? Okay, I get confused here. They've got the tap at the top and the keyboard at the bottom because if you've seen my reviews you will know this definitely is a keyboard tablet here keyboard here all right okay you got all the indicators here And all these bonds on this side. You can see that. Which I already covered all that. That's the air vent here. That's the pen. All that inside there, isn't it? And here you can see clearly. This is a DC jack in. This is a LAN for your network. HDMI USB 2.0. All right. Same here, you can see everything here as well.
then yeah you can see that DC jack in on the tablet and then the keyboard at the bottom USB 2.0 and the VGA enjoy the image Next image. Right. So all that stuff has been covered now. Now we're gonna go into the keyboard. Yeah, these images are being taken from different websites, so don't worry about that. They're not my own, don't worry. I'm here just to show you pictures of from different for the tablet and the keyboard. Here you can see the tablet support holder. Let me do that again. I don't know what happened there. Here is a tablet support holder. Okay. Here the tablet gets fits into this connector. And this is a keyboard with keys. Okay. Uh, this is a touchpad. And this is a mass bronze, but you can't really tell what it is. Okay. Anyway, enjoy the image. Okay, next image. Woohoo, really big. We'll go for this one. I think this one's been blurry. So this is another image of the keyboard. Now what they've done here, the tablet support holder is gone down. It's gone forward, hasn't it? So it's more like in a shut position. Enjoy this image. Now you can see everything clearly now. Okay, you can see there's like it's got like two connectors here, isn't it? Where the tablet will fit into. Okay, the holder, the tablet support holder, is moving forward to see clearly what's on there. Enjoy the image. If you look at this image right, you're getting a these kind of ports on the keyboard. This is the DC jack in which powers up this thing and charges it, the battery inside it, okay. This is your LAN which is a wired network connection 
for your RG45 cable. This is a HDMI port which is for connected to monitor and television. And this is the USB 2.0 port for your connectivity for USB. Enjoy the image. This was really important to show. Why am I showing you this? This is a register stylistic. Okay. It's a KB docking station. Per dock number is FPCKE080. Part number, register number. And the DC is 19 voltage. Okay. But just to limit it. Oh, whoa, 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 check this out. You usually don't get all this, do you? Made in Japan. Okay? I'll repeat that again. Made in Japan. And this is a Progestive keyboard. So it's a Progestive Stylistic Q704 keyboard. And is made in Japan. Enjoy this image. It's a big one, this one, isn't it? Okay, next image. Big made in Japan. There you have it. Yeah, this is the back side of the just to stylistic Q704 keyboard. Alright. And here I think the battery is here. Okay. Battery must be here. If we look clearly at this image. You probably have to take the screws off or something, yeah? If you want to replace your battery, because the battery is down in this position, okay, down here. Because in terms of the diagram I've seen, seen the battery was placed here, and it's removable in this keyboard, all right. So don't think it is. It is. I think I'll show that diagram as well about the where the batteries and the information that the manufacturer has given about the removable battery. So I'm going to show that in pictures as well. So anyway, enjoy this image. Next image. Now this is the other side where the ports are. Yeah. On this side you get USB 2.0 and a VGA port. It's pretty good actually. Because even the keyboard's got some few ports for you there. So you don't miss any of the ports. And, but this has done a good job with this keyboard you see you got ports on the tablet and keyboard you got ports on both it's very very good because you got a lot a lot of ports there, haven't you put all together 
So anyway, enjoy the image. Okay, so that was the final image, by the way. Yeah, it was. <laughs> and I hope you guys enjoyed my video session today on the Fujitsu Stylistic Q704 tablet and keyboard photos. Now you've got clear seeing of my photos what the thing actually looks like as a full tablet PC from okay, a tablet and a keyboard at the bottom and the ports of the tablet and the keyboard with these photos so this is really good now now everything is covered for you but still we need to go into our next video where, where I need to show you a keyboard diagram the back of the keyboard where the battery is and where they show it is removable okay that needs to be shown I think still because this doesn't actually cover it does it properly I want you guys to see this properly that it really this keyboard does have a removable battery Okay. The tablet might not have a removal battery, but the keyboard does. So we're going to look into a bit more into that. If the tablet and the keyboard does have a removal battery. We'll see what I'm our next video. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video for today. Keep your likes, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.